Okay, it looks like that last video didn't have any sound. Uh, thank you, Ronald Keith, for pointing that out and uh, take two, as it were. Uh, just like I said in the last video, watch out when people say you're good. Not so much if you're doing a good job. You may be doing a good job, and someone may notice that and commend you for it. But when someone says you are good, you're good, Darren, if they're talking to me. You have to watch for that because if I if I accept that, if I allow that person to to say that and, and me accept that as truth, then I'm also saying that they have the authority to say when I'm bad. Okay? So watch out when a person says you're good. Because again, you're if you accept that you're empowering them to dictate whether or not you're bad. So here you are, you're on this roller coaster ride of people telling you you're good and bad and they're dictating how you feel about yourself and how you look at other people. And No. Allow the Holy Spirit of God in your prayer life to tell you where you stand when it comes to you being good or bad. Allow God to be that measure and have that authority to say you're good or you're bad. You know, Remember the, the rich young ruler had asked, uh, well, he approached Jesus and said, Good master. And Jesus said, Why do you call me good? No one's good but God. Jesus himself didn't even let a person, because he wanted that person. I believe there's many reasons of, of the wisdom of why Christ would say anything to a person. I mean, if you just really dig deep. But one thing we can see from, from his reply to that young man is that he wanted him to see what it is he's actually saying what is good he, he wanted him to maybe look within himself and to determine what is good again it's a it can be a deep subject and I don't want to just delve too deep in because man it, I may blow my own mind <laughs> watch when people say you're good and watch when you're accepting that 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 flattery and that pat on the back Again, if you're accepting whether or not a, some person is saying you're good, then you're also accepting them when they're saying you're bad or indifferent or in between, mediocre. Okay, allow the Holy Spirit of God in your prayer life to dictate whether or not you are good or if you are bad. Okay? Allow God to have that authority and that power in your life. Allow Him to be the one to brings about your esteem, your your self-confidence and self-assurance because that should only rely in the person of Christ Jesus. Let Christ, look, everybody has a, a, a hero or a model. Allow God to be your model. Allow Him to be your hero. And allow Him to dictate whether or not you're good or whether or not you're doing bad. Amen. I love you guys.